want to say these names right now, but they teach their apprentice how to become a shaman. Oh my fucking God. They're demanding teachers, but their students is dedicated. All three put hard work, put in hard work that pays off with success of a new generation. This is studying, growth, collaboration, success, recognition. So you and your motherfucking spirit guides. And that's what I said. This person admires you. You're teaching them how to become a shaman. They probably never really even tapped into that energy, but they're so inspired. And they see that your students are very dedicated as well. And you're about to get that recognition. And I'm going to say for these enemies, they actually have really poor work ethic and a fucking lack of goals. So that's why they watch you so hard. That's why they watch you so hard because they see, they see you. They see that works that you put in. It's like idea after idea, the idea gets fucking taken or fucked up and you just come up with another one and another one temperance because you're in this meditative state and spirit delivers it to you i feel like you deliver this person from evil as well but they're gonna have a lot of karma for keeping this shit to themselves two of cups yeah because this is what they feel about you look at that devil energy You're teaching them how to soften themselves, how to love. And I feel like they're going to be coming forward or they're going to be starting to recognize who you are. The hermit, but you'll be long gone. You'll be long gone by the time they fucking show up. Let's get the outcome. What's the outcome spirit? Page of Cups. This is your fate. This is your destiny. And like I said, this is for your children as well. For those of you that have children, or I'm seeing that you're inspiring a lot of youth. Allowing them to step into their destiny because you did it and you weren't afraid. And I do see someone. I'm seeing someone with a beautiful home. And animals that surrounds them. And I'm smelling flowers, the ocean, or this may even be a river or a lake. Somewhere where there's fresh water source. I'm seeing somebody drinking coconut water a lot as well. And if you aren't, you're being called to. Let's get one more for the outcome. I do feel like someone's going to be having a child very soon for those of you that wanted one or this could just be the birth of the birth of you of your legacy of peace and harmony six of coins look at that she's freeing the bugs She's freeing the bugs. You're someone very connected to the creature spirits. You just want everybody to be free. I feel like that's why you're here, not to just like literally free people. I'm seeing even somebody doing pro bono work in the justice system. But with the animals as well, somebody wants everybody to be free. Somebody wants to free people's mind. And I feel like even with those darker energies, you know, those, those that, you know, spirit warned you about them to stay away from them. It's like you weren't afraid because you knew deep down something was wrong with them. They were in this self-imprisonment and you too wanted them to be free because you know that when you move with love, we all got to move with love. It got to be a collective thing. So that's why you never wanted to make it there alone you always wanted to light the way with people because there's no sense of you going there and you're the only one there 
You want them there with you. The Hierophant. The High Priest energy. You got that priest vibes. But the Sacred Priest. Right? Because we'd be seeing what's been going on with these priests. And that's why the power is being shifted into the right hands. Because the power has been in the wrong hands for far too long. Through lies. Through deceit. Through someone else's energy. I'm hearing energy harvesting. Through someone else's ideas. It's not okay. And spirit's not standing for it. Let's read Buffalo Woman. It's the white buffalo woman. The buffalo has been coming up again because it's felt like a storm. And the buffalo knows how to get through a storm. They get through it quickly. They don't stay there. And that's what it is, right? We talked about movement. It's about not staying there. Moving. You, feel, you hear the storm warning? Well, fucking move. You know what I mean? Keep pushing on. Forward. The Hierophant is a divine figure and teacher who shares the rules, rites, and rituals to follow as a community. Yes, that's you, the community vibes, and you share. You don't hoard this fucking energy. There is a place for everyone and everyone in their place. She encourages the comfort and support of the group, the path well-trodden. Speaks of conformity, compassion, social approval, tradition, and legacy. You're creating a whole new legacy. And traditions as well. All right. So there's a lot of beautiful things coming towards you, collective. And I'm going to read this because my eyes got drawn to the reversal of this card for the enemies. It says bucking trends. So it's like they always want to be on the latest fucking trend or maybe whatever trend you on. It's like you're a trendsetter. You got that energy. And it's like they also have this blind fate. Like they don't know where the fuck they're going. They're probably waiting for you to tell them where they're going. It's that type of energy. I don't want to end it like that. But Spirit said, nah, point that shit out. So, okay, let's get an Angels and Ancestors. I still have not found the book, but it's somewhere. But I feel like you're in this place of knowing you are the book. You are the book. Angels and Ancestors, let's get a closing message for the collective. Remember to hit that like button and this is a collective reading. Take what resonates, leave the rest. Autumn, release the old and rest. Release the old and rest. You could be seeing a lot of ravens or crows in these times, hearing a lot of birds, making a lot of noise. They're trying to prepare you or call you to release. They're also calling you to rest. I feel like being like a bird, the bird rises up when the sun rises and they start settling down and going to bed when the sun goes down. I feel like this will help you release this energy from your energetic field. Release. Be like nature and let the dead leaves fall off. Let me just get one card i just heard about uh, asking about love is there love coming towards the collective spirit is there love coming towards the collective Oof. four of swords recovering from the tower i feel like in these times they really want you to heal they really want you to love yourself because you're still you have to recoup you're still recovering from something and it could be this enemy vibe, right? That could have been a lover doing all this shit to you and giving all your information to whoever the fuck they're giving it to. But no, <laughs> no love coming. They want you to recover. They want you to love yourself. All right. But I don't know. 
I feel like through that process of you healing, somebody's definitely going to be coming in. But there has to be healing done first. Yeah. All right. I love you all. Hit that like button. If you want to book a personal reading, that information is found down below in the description box.